The greatest source of groundwater data for the United States is the USGS. You can access this data through their website, waterdata.usgs.gov NWIS and navigating down to groundwater. Here you have options to search for current conditions. So this is data for over 1700 wells, generally going back to the early 2000s, collecting real time data, often at 15 minute in intervals. You also have options to look at historical data for wells that go further back in time and give you different options for the type of data that you wanna download. So if we move on to current conditions, you can search for wells by state and well ID number. So if I scroll down to Pennsylvania, I can find an observation well in Philadelphia County and click on its well ID number. And it takes me to that old page. So the USGS has updated their station pages. So we'll go to the new generation. And you see a plot here for the past seven days, depth to water level. So with increasing depth, you have the water level dropping over time. And you can look at the past 30 days, one year. So you'll notice for those early times, it looks like this stepwise decrease, which is just a product of the detection limit. So if we look at the last year of water elevation for Philadelphia, um, note that the, the most recent data is orange. That just means that it's provisional. And once it's been reviewed and approved, it will look green as well. So we have the option to compare this year to the um, previous year so that we see in the lighter green record. And then to compare both of those to the median water elevations for the years 2013 to 2020. So we can see by looking at this, that this current year we're slightly lower than median levels, um, but that last year we had much higher water table levels than um, the median. You can also look at custom um, time periods. So if I wanted to look at the water years 2018 and 2019, I could enter those in and pull up that data as well still can toggle for median. Then scrolling down to the bottom of the site, you have information on the monitoring well location. So this map is zoomable. And at the bottom of the page, you have information on the lat long coordinates of the monitoring well. 